हरे कृष्णा फिक्सिंग अ लीकिंग टैंक इज मोर इंपॉर्टेंट देन फिलिंग द टैंक सपोज वी हैव अ वाटर टैंक वेर वी स्टोर वाटर एंड वी फाइंड इट एज बिकम एम टी we may immediately oh i need water supply we may immediately start turning on a tap or get a pipe or get a bucket to start filling it now it's important naturally to fill an empty tank but if the tank has become empty not because of usage of the water but because there is a leakage at the bottom of the tank then again we fill the tank what is going to happen we may fill it but the water will leak out and no matter how many times we keep filling the tank the tank will keep leaking the water and in this way whatever we do it will not be productive we our effort in filling the tank will be wasted if we consider our consciousness to be like a tank of energy which we have and usually we need to be rejuvenated so whole day we do some activity do some work at night we feel exhausted and we sleep and we wake up again then we have restored our energy and with that energy when we work then uh, we we have got refreshed energy to work so that way we rest rejuvenates our energy in a sense it's like filling the tank uh, when it has become empty now sometimes even if we have rested adequately during the day still uh, during the night still during the daytime we start feeling very tired and we may find okay why am i feeling tired like this so we may think oh i need some sleep but if you have had in and enough rest sleep at night and still we are feeling tired at that time we may not be physically tired we may be mentally tired you know we may just be fed up of things sometimes if we are placed in situations which we don't like sometimes if we have to do things which we don't like sometimes if things are going up going in a way that we don't like then we start feeling fed up we start feeling tired and just don't feel like doing anything we feel de-energized and that mental tiredness we think oh i'm tired i need some sleep but actually physical tiredness can be rejuvenated by physical rest but mental tiredness cannot be rejuvenated by rest because the it's not rest that is needed what is happening is that our energy is getting sucked away and when our energy is getting sucked away sometimes after waking up also rather than feeling rested we feel frustrated oh that was not going on well and now i slept also so much time i wasted more time so uh, this happens when we are not addressing the problem so because of our negativity because of our resentment our our mental energy tank is getting leaked the energy is getting depleted and when the energy is getting depleted like this we need to fill it at the proper level not by physical rest so krishna talks about happiness in the mode of ignorance and he says ya swapnam bhayam shokam vishadam madame vachana vimunchati dur medha driti sa parth tamasi he talks about determination in the mode of ignorance and such determination means that one is always morose one is always pessimistic one is always miserable always worried so this sort of negative attitude is what saps our energy and his krishna says is representative of the mode of ignorance and when we find ourselves getting exhausted without doing anything exhausting just because of the state of things then we need to change our consciousness there is our energy is getting leaked because of that resentment that resentment comprises the leak by which our mental energy is going away and that resentment can be removed by devotion when we cultivate bhakti when we chant krishna's name when we study krishna's message when we connect with krishna through prayer through remembrance through service then that connection helps us see beyond the immediate situation okay whatever things may be going wrong krishna is in control and krishna will work things out for the work things out well eventually machitta sarva durgaani mat prasada tarishya se Krishna says in 18.58, "If you become conscious of me, you will pass over all obstacles by my grace." So, if we become conscious of Krishna, then this will happen. We, he will at least the resentment will go away because we are not thinking about the things that are going wrong. We are focusing on Krishna, 
and as we stop worrying about problems the problems also decrease in their magnitude in their severity and then we can gently calmly responsibly deal with the situation and move forwards in our life so this connection with krishna we feel i have so much work to do i don't have energy my tank is empty and i don't have time or energy for connecting with krishna but connecting with krishna is like fixing the leaking tank once we fix the leaking tank, we'll find that we have time, we have energy. The thing which was getting depleted and leaked earlier, that will be available for us for doing constructive work. So the time invested in, in fixing a leaking tank is not a wastage. Although visibly we may not see any result immediately, but it's an investment which will give, which will make our work of filling the tank, tank meaningful. Similarly, the time when we spend in bhakti, that will fix the leaking tank of our consciousness and that will make the other work that we do, the energy that we put in our other work, it will make it more productive. Thank you. Hare Krishna.